It's a busy day in sports in Florida. Tonight we have a UFC fight in the city of Jacksonville. But first, we go to Cole Pepper, who joins us from Tallahassee for a special event. What's happening there, Cole? Well, it not only is the spring game for Florida State, the Garnet and Gold game, it's also the last broadcast for the legendary voice of the Seminoles, Gene Deckerhoff. As far as the spring game is concerned, not going to be much more than a scrimmage. It's going on right now behind me. But Gene Deckerhoff honored today after 43 years as the full-time voice of the Seminoles. He was on the field, and he pointed out that's where his Florida State football broadcast started. He did Bobby Bowden's first spring game back in 1976, so fitting that his last broadcast comes at a spring game as well. The Jacksonville native and former Forest High School, now River, uh, now Westside High School alum, has a lot of memories through the years. And I asked him after the pregame ceremony how his emotions were getting ready for his final broadcast. What's the what's the emotions right now? Well, <laughs> I was doing pretty good. And, uh, standing on the field, I said a little prayer and I got a little energy from above. And we made it through. That was the hard part. The second part is now we got to go broadcast. Well, we'll have more from Gene Deckroff coming up tonight at 10 and 11. Uh, the Jacksonville native said he got his itch, sort of, the first entry into his broadcast career doing the public address announcing at his high school when his brother is playing football. We'll hear that coming up tonight. Also, I want to mention uh, for the moment that at the Masters, Scotty Scheffler continues to lead, just a bogey the 14th, but he's a 10 under par for the tournament. A four-stroke lead over the players' champion, Cam Smith, the Jacksonville resident, Charles Schwartzel, the 2011 Masters champion, is at minus four. There are only 10 golfers who have shot under par so far today. Very difficult scoring conditions at the Masters. Of course, it is a very busy day, as uh, you mentioned, including downtown. Justin Barney is at the arena getting ready for tonight's UFC fight. Justin, what's the scene down there?